Today, we're headed to the Ford dealership to grab some brochures and take a brief look at the new 1967 F-Series pickup trucks. Ford kicked off 1967 with a redesigned pickup from the previous year's more curvy design, with the 1966 model offering a Ranger package Ford carried on with this as an option for 1967. The Ranger package is a more refined truck with upscale trim and features. The 1967 trucks were still built to be worked, but now offered a truck that can work hard and be used as a daily driver or for recreational purposes. With slogans like, works like a truck, rides like a car, Ford began a trend we see today in the luxury truck market with the Ranger package leading the way. First introduced in 1965 on F100 and F250 series trucks was the twin I-beam front suspension design, which had two front axles, one for each side. Wheels roll over bumps independently to smooth out the ride on any road surface. This gave the trucks a smooth car-like comfortable ride and confident handling while providing a tough hard working design. Paint colors offered were Rangoon Red, Pebble Beige, Raven Black, Springtime Yellow, Holly Green, Lunar Green, Frost Turquoise, Harbor Blue, Wimbledon White, Chrome Yellow, and Pure White. Regular two-tone paint options were available on F100, 250, and 350. Deluxe two-tone paint options were available on F100 and 250 style sides. Ford included many safety features as standard for 1967 in F100, 250, and 350 series trucks to include dual hydraulic brake system with warning light, seat belts, padded instrument panel, safety door latches and hinges, outside mirror, windshield washers, two-speed wipers, padded sun visors, laminate safety plate windshield glass, four-way flashers, and more. Convenience options such as power brakes, power steering, select shift automatic, bucket seats and optional center console, transistorized radio, and dealer install select air conditioner. Offered in three trim levels, standard cab, custom cab, and Ranger. Each has variations in style and comfort, but could be configured with virtually the same engine, transmission, and bed options. Standard cab features include a padded instrument panel color keyed to exterior paint, attractive functional instrument cluster, foot-operated parking brake, push-button glove box latch, aluminum door scuff plates, slide-action air vents, deluxe fresh air heater and defroster, a one-piece hardboard headliner, and full-width vinyl trim seating color keyed to cab paint. Custom cab option with all F100, 250, and 350 series offered plenty of luxury and comfort. Woven plastic seat trim color keyed to exterior paint. Deep foam cushion full with seat that can seat three big people comfortably. Armrest, rubber floor mats color keyed to exterior paint. Cigarette lighter, bright finish horn ring, headlight retainer molding, and instrument cluster further added to the cab interior looks. Bright metal grille, headlight assembly, taillight bezels, windshield reveal moldings, and the custom cab plaques give the custom cab exterior a distinctive appearance. Ranger package was top of the line for F100 and F250 style side trucks. A full width deep cushion seat is upholstered in highly styled durable vinyl with a soft cloth appearance vinyl door trim panels, deep pile carpeting, handsomely trimmed with bright metal moldings, upholstery is color keyed to main body colors, the horn ring, instrument cluster, head lining, and instrument padding moldings are bright finished. Outside bright front bumper, grill, headlight assembly, hubcaps, wheel lip, rocker panel, and tailgate moldings all to identify this Ranger as Ford's finest full-size pickup truck. Style side, flare side, and stake and platform models offered on a 115-inch wheelbase and 6.5-foot box.
a 131 inch wheelbase and eight foot box for style side and flare side F100 and F250. Seven and a half foot box for the 131 inch wheelbase F250 stake and platform models. Flare side and stake and platform models offered a new 135 inch wheelbase nine foot box for F350 models. Stake and platform models also offered a 159 inch wheelbase and 12 foot box for F350 models, as well as dual wheels for extra load carry capacity. Ford F100 4x4 has a mono beam front suspension and provides outstanding stability, ride, and handling. Radius rods absorb driving and braking torque. Front coil springs provide a softer ride, and a track bar maintains axle alignment and provides lateral stability. Ford F250 4x4 suspension consists of rugged long life leaf springs with lubrication free shackles. Double acting front and rear shocks ease the ride over rough terrain. F100 4x4 has a single speed direct drive transfer case coupled to a four speed transmission. F250 4x4 has a two-speed transfer case and three-speed manual transmission. Four-speed transmission is optional. Power takeoff openings are on four-speed transmissions and the F250's two-speed transfer case. Both series have a single shift lever to operate the transfer case. Front drive axle is a single speed full floating axle with hypoid type drive gearing. Gears are alloy steel, heat treated and carburized for extra strength. Carrier housing is a cast center section with bolted cover plate. Housing is steel axle tubes press fitted and welded to the carrier housing. Front drive components are Cardan universal joints that provide an even flow of power to the front wheels in all turning positions. Optional free running front hubs eliminate front axle gear drag and wear when in two wheel drive. Steering gear provides precise low effort steering. Ford trucks offered several camper special models on the F100, 250 and 350, 131 inch wheelbase up to 159 inch wheelbase chassis for the F350. The F100, F250 camper specials offer a choice of either the 300 cubic inch big six or 352 cubic inch V8 with either a four speed manual or select shift cruise-o-matic automatic transmission. F350 offered the 352 cubic inch V8 with four speed or cruise-matic transmission. Other features available, limited slip rear axle, power steering, power brakes, custom cab or Ranger, air conditioner, oil pressure gauge, ammeter, dual electric horns, Western style mirrors, extra cooling radiator, and camper special emblems. And a rundown on some specs. We'll start with the engine. 240 cubic inch six cylinder, 150 horsepower, 234 pound foot of torque, 9.2 to 1 compression ratio. 306 is 170 horsepower, 283 pound foot of torque, 7.9 to 1 compression ratio. 352 V8, 208 horsepower, 315 pound foot of torque. 8.9 to 1 compression ratio. Transmissions were three speed manual, four speed manual, and the three speed cruise automatic automatic. Price and production. These were hard to nail down. Here's what we found half ton style side short bed. Base price $2,237, which equals $20,079 in 2023. Half ton style side long wheelbase, 2,273, which equals 20,402 in 2023. Half ton flare side short bed, $2,198, equals 
equals 19,729 in 2023. Half ton flare side long wheelbase, $2,237 equals $20,079 in 2023. Three quarter ton flare side, $2,409 equals $21,622 in 2023. Three quarter ton style side, $2,446 equals $21,955 in 2023. One ton flare side, $2,550 equals $22,888 in 2023. And for production, the total production for the F100 in all styles, uh, that came up to 230,082. The total production for the F250 in all styles equals 74,503. And the total production for F350 in all styles was 25,996. The 1967 through 1972 Ford pickups are known amongst truck enthusiasts as the bump side, the name given because the raised body bump running front to back. No matter what pickup truck camp you prefer, the 1967 bump side trucks are great looking trucks that hold their own whether original stock, mild modified, or all out custom. With the aftermarket body and parts suppliers offering more and more support for these trucks, Hopefully, they can remain on the streets and show fields for all to enjoy for a long time to come. Thanks for watching to the end. If you like this video, please subscribe so that we can grow this channel and bring more content to you in the future.